boom. What's up, Money Geeks? Mr. V here. Welcome to another video, guys. So in today's video, we are going to talk about ticket symbol LAC Lithium America. So this is a company that we cover here on the channel when nobody was talking about it and when the company was still like in the dust. Uh, I started covering it because I saw the potential of what they were doing. I saw the projects that they were working on and I looked at the future like, hey, if we're going EV, this is going to be massive. So I started buying stocks in this company. Uh, we're going to talk about it today. I'm going to give you guys some price projection and what I see uh, moving forward. But before we get started, guys, if you're new to the channel, we talk about how to earn money, how to save money, how to invest and build wealth. So if that's something that interests you, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content. So when it comes to lithium, this is again uh, one of the plays that I keep telling you guys that if we are looking to move into the electric space, electric vehicle space, I uh, want to go with this green energy. One of the key ingredients that powers all the things that we're talking about here, especially cars, it's lithium. So you go, Tesla needs a lot of lithium. Uh, Lucid needs a, a lot of lithium. Every car manufacturer needs a lot of lithium to power their vehicles. Um, again, except for the ones that are using hydrogen. But majority of them are lithium based. So what does that mean? It means the demand for lithium would skyrocket. And there's companies out there that currently produce lithium, but I, I, again, for me, I'm looking at disruptors. I'm looking for companies that have massive potential uh, with very limited downside. And Lithium America was one of them. And remember, when we started talking about it, this thing was trading somewhere around 10 bucks when we started talking about it. Uh, so I'm gonna jump right here so we can actually take a look. Again, for those of you that don't know, I'm gonna put the links in the description. You can go read about the company. They have two major projects, one in uh, North America in Nevada, which is like one of the largest uh, lithium deposit and then there's a massive project in Argentina which that one I think goes live in 2022 so again these guys are approaching production and they're moving fast and the demand for lithium is only going to go up from here so that's something that I'm, I'm excited about so definitely go go read about them again this uh this is their south america project and it's the tacker pass um that that's the one in nevada so just definitely go go read about them i don't want you to just uh, again blindly invest make sure that you go there read the investor presentation and see why this is a, a good company and that's the reason why i think this company has uh, a lot of room to grow and again, because I see that there is a massive demand for lithium coming up because all these other companies, when they are ramping up, they're telling you like, hey, Tesla want to produce more vehicles uh, with, because of the deal that they signed with Hertz. It means they need more battery, they need more lithium. Uh, if Lucid has to meet the demand of their vehicles, they need more batteries, they need more lithium. So this is definitely a play that has tremendous upside. But again, with every upside comes a little bit of downside. So the, the Argentina uh, uh, production facility is going fine with uh, Lithium America. They're not having any issues down there because obviously there's a lot of companies around it that are mining Lithium already. So they're just joining uh, the herd of you know, pl players in the space. But the Tucker Pass in Nevada is getting some pushback from our environmentalists. So uh, Native Americans and um, environmentalists are complaining about the fact that this is going to damage the environment, which uh, obviously I, I can see from their perspective, um, Native Americans want to protect the land uh, because that is uh, where the ancestors uh, kind of lived and, and grew and did stuff. And um, environmentalists want the environment to stay the way it is. Um, which sometimes it's a cash 22 if you want clean energy because it's bad for the environment and that clean energy comes with lithium but yet you don't want people to mine lithium so it's it's a tough one I am not the guy that's gonna make that decision so I'm just happy um, that I, all I can do here is invest so again that is the challenge that they are getting uh, but on the positive side I'm gonna bring some news here lithium America makes an offer to acquire millennia lithium this is a, a Canadian based lithium company so they, again if you can see here they try they start looking at consolidation um, they have these two major uh, passes or projects that they have uh, the North America and the South American projects but now they're bringing in other 
uh, uh, companies is trying to build, start expanding um, and getting bigger and bigger, which I like. I like that consolidation uh, because it, it makes you uh, more of a reputable player in this space. So they make that offer for about 400 million um, to acquire a millionaire uh, lithium. So again, that hasn't been voted. We'll see as soon as that goes through. So if that goes through, I think it'd be a huge, huge play for them. So again, those are some of the things that I, I want to. So you can go to their website. They have information here that will definitely help you under their investor presentation and just kind of take a look. So um, now that we're doing this video, if we can go take a look at Lithium America, West currently trading somewhere around $34 or $33 and some change. Um, again, when we started covering the stock, this is where I got into the stock somewhere here around uh, September of last year, I started talking about this stock. You can go back and watch the videos. I, I, when I was even looking on, 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 on YouTube, pretty much there was nobody there was talking about this stock. And I was like, this is a huge opportunity. You guys know my approach to, to investing and to finding these disruptors. Um, I don't go find the cute names. When, because again, when somebody's already talking about it, when Wall Street is already talking about it, it's getting too late. So I try to get in as soon as possible. That's why you hear me talk about Lithium America. You hear me talk about cooler technology. These things that people don't talk about right now that would eventually explode um, in the future. So that is why uh, I, I love this one. So right now it went from that $10. Look at that first squeeze. I think this was back in uh, uh, December or early January of 2021. And then pull back and you can see now look at from here when it pull back it's only squeezed all the way up to 34 it, it got to a high of 36 dollars so again um and there's still tremendous amount of upside to this thing this uh production facility in nevada gets approved if it goes through all the legal issues that they have to they've done their feasibility study um, they have a massive report on their website. You can go read that on the feasibility study, which basically means this is how this project is going to impact the environment. They've already done that. So you can definitely go check it out um, on their website. And so if all that goes well and it has proof, remember last year, I even told you guys when um, Trump uh, administration already gave them the first, the first pass um, for this particular project. So I'm assuming that the Biden infrastructure bill which is uh, really heavy on um, EV clean energy, I think would play a major part because you cannot be pushing for clean energy, pushing for electric vehicles, pushing for charging stations, but then at the same time, rejecting uh, a lithium mining pass. That's, it just doesn't make any sense. If you go that route, then I, I wonder what you're trying to do. So I assume that the Biden administration would push and validate this pass so they can stop mining that lithium. So uh, again, that's my take. I wanted to give you guys um, this particular update. So what does that mean uh, for the price of the stock right now? Again, like I said, it's sitting somewhere at about $34 right now. Um, this one, for me, it's a long-term play. This thing would, if, they, if that pass gets approved, and as soon as they start production in South America, and they start production in Nevada, this thing is gonna explode. And uh, from a, uh, j just from a logistic standpoint, this is very critical because if they mine the lithium in North America, which means that the demand for lithium is going to be satisfied by uh, companies within the United States. So no logistics involved. Tesla has a, a manufacturing facility in Nevada. Uh, Lucid has a facility in Arizona. So again, that stays within the US, which is massive. And then you can say, hey, they're gonna employ a ton of people in the United States. So for me, from a government standpoint, there's every reason why they should approve this and make this, uh, this, this project move forward. So again, if you want to get into the stock, I say you should make a, a habit of being a bottom feeder. If you want to invest long term, feed from the bottom. Each time there's a dip, you buy a little bit. Each time there's a dip, you buy a little bit. Because if you're waiting for that massive dip, unless there's a crash in the market, and again, if it's a long term uh, mentality, 
you cannot sit there and be waiting because that's never going to come to you so always buy the dip become a bottom feeder each time you see a dip in the price you pick a few shares i don't care if it's just 50 if it's 25 each time you see a dip in the price you pick a few shares so again long term this thing is over a hundred dollars easy in my personal estimation and the caveat for that is if the, the projects get approved um south america is approved already because they're looking production in 2022 uh, North America, right now, I'm just waiting for the Biden administration to sign papers and, and let these guys go. Um, again, like I said, they've completed their feasibility study, um, massive report. And I mean, they're probably working now with the environmental groups and Native American groups to try to negotiate how this is going to go. At the end of the day, in my personal opinion, it comes down to money. All the environmental groups are going to take money. And they're going to calm down native americans they're going to give them some sort of a, a reward um maybe compensation um again they, hey what do you want should we not do this and then the environment gets destroyed because we're driving fossil fuel cars or should we do this and save the environment which one do you want so that again that's just my take so uh, as of right now um at 34 dollars just wait for a little dip that's when you buy wait for a little dip that's when you buy and don't if again this is for long term um if you're looking to swing trade it uh i say pump the brakes right now and just wait uh, because this thing has made a massive move uh, most recently so after those crazy moves um there's usually a pullback a little bit of consolidation before we move up so wait for that pullback under 30 uh that would be ideal in my personal opinion under 30 start start accumulating um and add as we go so that's uh how i would play it if i were in your shoes again let me know in the comment section what you guys think about this if you're new here we talk about how to earn money how to save money how to invest and build wealth so if that's something that interests you go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on new content also guys again i mentioned this uh mumu has this crazy uh I mean, as a matter of fact, promotion where if you sign up to their, 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 their app and deposit any amount of money, $1, whatever, you get five free stacks value somewhere between nine and $3,900 or $3,500. I'll put the links in the description below. Definitely go check them out. You can sign up, get your free stocks and transfer them to uh, whichever platform you choose to use. Again, it's free money in my personal opinion. Again, uh, I'll put the links in the description below. And as always, guys, do your due diligence. Don't be a greedy savage. Stay motivated. Oh, 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 oh